What's going on, YouTube? This is to all the fallen angels out there that are stuck on drugs and alcohol. Hey, let's listen to this uh, few lyrics of this song, my favorite song. I love it. Fallen Angel, Cora, please stop song. Let's listen to the uh, few lyrics. This is killing me, you know, I'm out there every day, I watch the news, all these people hooked on drugs, they're being laced with uh, fentanyl, plus tranquilizer, kids, young adults, older adults, they're like zombies out there, it's insane, it's like something right out of the movie. This hits home. But I was out there. I was out there for a lot, a lot of years. Maybe 15 years of my life. And I'm sober today. I'm coming on 17. I'm coming on, sorry, 18 years of September. Of sobriety. So it breaks my heart when I see these people out there. I think that there's no way out. The kids, the kids of our future, and they're stuck on this, uh, these drugs that are being cut with fentanyl. Force tranquilizer, I believe it is. It's powerful shit. People are dying every day. Hundreds, hundreds of people are dying every day from this stuff. And Pete is insane because people find out that people are dying from this stuff and they want it. It's insane. It's like they want to die. Do they? Do they really want to die? I, 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 I really don't believe in my heart that they want to die. They're just chasing that good high. And you know, people die from good. It's insane. Beat America. Wake up. Wake up. They're taking you out. Little by little, they're taking us out. These drugs coming from all these other countries. You gotta wake up. You could, you could stop. You really could. I know, I know you think you can't. I know it's easier said than done. But you could stop. As long as you have some hope, you could stop this insanity. I know, easier said than done. I was out there. I didn't think I could stop. That's all I knew. I was like uh, a slave. First thing I got up in the morning, I would take my fix, and then it was out to the races to go get that next hit. And I did whatever, whatever I had to do to go get that next hit. You'd be surprised how smart most of these addicts are, drug addicts. You don't know what they got to do to to go get that next hit. If they only reverse it into a positive way, the sky's the limit for most of these people. And the, our kids, our kids are getting hooked on these pills. 
that are being mixed in with fentanyl, the opiates. It's, it's insanity. People, you got to wake up. You got to wake up. You're not stuck. As long as you don't give up hope, which I hope you don't, you're not stuck, and you can change this around. I take it. I was there. Thank God that back then when I was there, the drugs weren't being cut with fentanyl like they are today. Well, who knows where I would be? Maybe I wouldn't be here talking to you guys. But guys, please, stop living in modern day slavery and walking around like zombies. You could change. You just got, if you don't have that family support behind you, like I did, I was one of the lucky ones that had the family support that didn't give up on me when I was giving up on myself. You still, you still have you. You still have yourself. Do you really, you gotta ask yourself, do you really wanna live like this? Do you wanna live in misery? Do you wanna wake up chasing this shit? I, I don't think you do. You're just stuck. But you could, you could do it. You really could. Take it from me. I didn't think I could do it. And here I am, 17 years of sobriety. And you know what? I don't sleep on that. I don't get comfortable with that. Because I could fall right back. Once I get too comfortable and think that I'm cured, I could be right back. So I take it one day at a time, stay humble, and keep it here. Keep it in the back of my mind that I could go right back if I get too comfortable. So I know I'm an addict for the rest of my life, but I'm a recovered addict for today. Just for today. I don't worry about tomorrow. I worry about today. That's it. And today, it's going to go by. And then tomorrow when I wake up, I worry about that. But I'm coming on 18 years. God willing. Of sobriety. That's insane when I look back. I'm out there in the city and I see all these kids. And all these, it's, it's, it's straight out of the movie. Zombies. Chasing this shit. These drugs. This country, this government is so worried about the coronavirus. How about being worried about all these, all these drugs being cut up with fentanyl? Come on, we know we could do something about this. And for the people that are out there and you're selling this stuff, I hope you get what you got coming to you because it doesn't last forever. You're killing our kids. You're killing our people. But... America, don't let them do it. Don't let them do it. You got to stop this shit.